Authorities asked residents of communities along river banks and in low-lying neighborhoods to move to higher ground, after floodwaters hit a 50-year high, state television reported. The peak discharge of the swollen Beijiang River near Guangdong's capital Guangzhou is expected to reach 20,000 cubic meters per second, a flow of a size that probably occurs once every 100 years. The flood alert for Beijiang River had been raised to level 1, the highest, at 10 p.m. local time. Guangdong's Qingyuan city, near Xiaoguan, also raised its flood alert to the highest level at around noon as the waters rose. In Jiangxi province to the northeast, authorities raised a flood red alert after 485,000 people in nine districts were affected, Xinhua News Agency said. Economic losses reached 470 million yuan, $70.21 million, with 43,300 hectares of crops destroyed. There is also the risk that the effect of the disruption floods bring in China can be felt further afield as Chinese goods become more important in global supply chains. China's Central Meteorological Observatory maintained a high-temperature orange warning for northern areas such as central and southern Hebei, most of Beijing and parts of Shandong, Tianjin and Hunan.